there are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. This is the weather video for Saturday, January 9th, 2021. We'll have a dry and cool weekend before some of us in central Alabama may see some wintry precipitation on Monday. After that, dry weather returns with moderating temperatures. We'll get to that in just a minute. Just a quick note, I am producing this video just before midnight on Friday night. If there is a drastic change in the thinking of the forecast, I'll have an updated post out later this morning. We'll start off with a look at the SPC outlooks. Today will feature the potential for thunderstorms over southern Texas and western New Mexico, but no severe weather is expected across the country. Nearly the same story for Sunday as no severe weather is expected across the country, but thunder will be possible from southern Texas to extreme southern Mississippi. Rainfall amounts through the next seven days show that most locations in central Alabama will be around or just below one quarter of an inch. Some slightly higher totals may be possible over the south and southwestern parts of the area. And a quick look at the forecast temperatures from the National Blend of Models show that temperatures will stay in the 40s in the central parts of the area through Tuesday before slightly warmer weather moves in through the last day of the forecast period in the 50s. Lows will range from the mid-20s to the upper 30s. Now let's jump into the models as we'll start off with the 0Z run of the GFS valid today at 3 p.m. The cold core upper low that brought us showers and a few snow showers and flurries will be well off of the east coast on Saturday, but we will see the next low beginning to develop over the Four Corners region. We'll be dry and very cool across central Alabama with partly to mostly cloudy skies. Highs will be in the upper 30s to the upper 40s. Sunday will be a brighter day across the area as we'll have mostly sunny skies throughout much of the day before clouds start to move in late. We'll stay dry and afternoon highs will be in the lower 40s to the lower 50s. The low I mentioned earlier will be moving in our direction on Monday, but will be weakening as it approaches the area and moves through and exits the area on Tuesday. At this point, the GFS is very stingy with any snowfall and keeping nearly all of the activity as a cold rain. However, the European model is very close in agreement, but is allowing for a little more opportunity for flurries on the backside of the shower activity. The system really loses its punch and the shower activity will be out of here by midnight, if not earlier. A few flurries may end it off on the backside, but there should be no travel issues late as daytime highs will be in the lower 40s to the lower 50s, with lows staying above freezing for everyone in central Alabama except for the northwestern quarter of the area. The GFS probability of total snowfall map is showing only a 10% chance of one inch of snowfall or greater for the extreme northwestern parts of the state. And the European model is a little more bullish with those chances for the northwestern quarter of the state, ranging from 10% to 40% as you move northwest. With that being said, we'll have to watch locations northwest of a line from Fayette to Jasper to Holly Pond to Scottsboro for the potential of some minor accumulations and a few slick spots early. Stay tuned for forecast updates through the weekend. The moisture will be well out of the area on Tuesday as skies start the slow process of clearing some. Highs will be in the mid-40s to the lower 50s. Wednesday will feature plenty of sunshine and slightly warmer temperatures as highs will be in the 50s across the area. Thursday will be a little warmer with highs reaching the mid-50s to the lower 60s underneath mostly sunny skies. A deepening trough will move into central Alabama on Friday that will bring us some clouds, but at this point rain does not look likely. However, temperatures will take a step backwards as highs will be in the lower 40s to the upper 50s. That will do it for today's video. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. Bill Murray will have the next video out on Sunday morning. I'm Scott Martin signing off for today. Have a great day and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.